freezer when I'm not the oldest one in the room. I told you. Totally. We got Granny and Grandpa over there. How could I be younger than any of you? Did you guys bring your life alert? Wait, wait, when's your date? When's your birthday? 15th of July. So you just turned. Well, in July. Okay, you guys are both old. That's all right. That's all right. I'm taking it. You guys are old. Anyway, take it. Tina. TJ Brazil has uh, something to share. You can call me BJ if you want. You know I hate BJ. Oh, you would rather have BJ for the mouth of that. Instead of Tina. BJ is gross. She I don't even like do that. She likes that better than you Tina. You know why I don't do I that? Sweating like, it's I'm sweating. I'm going to tell you why I don't. Okay. I have a little space in between my teeth. And it's, the it's parts cute. of it oh. get sucked up in there. And the guy's like, ah! Oh oh. So they usually tell me, it's okay. Just stop. It's okay. Just stop. This segment we won't send as well. I always thought that was kind of sexy. <laughs> well, yeah, until, until, until spinning stuff out no, your just teeth? a little, no, a little. It is, no, but is, when yeah. I'm, you know, your skin is going to show right up It's a careful dance. It happens. It's a fine balance, TJ, Brazil. Well, what do you have? What I had this week. Let me hold your mic. I've learned so you're much. you're going to show us something. <laughs> oh, you want to see my ass? I do. I want to see your ass. Oh, well, we want to start like that? I always want to see your ass. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Get it, girl. Work it. What chaps teaches us? <sighs> I was work, it? work, work. Looking good? I, I don't know. Good. I can't see. I can't see it either, but it looks good. Oh. Liz said it's looking great. <laughs> Bam! Ooh, that was right in the middle. Did you feel it was moist? Yeah. God. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, I have to haul these chairs after the show, so watch it. Baby. Oh boy. You like so have roadies? Right? <laughs> have you seen the way these two treat me? Who do you think the roadie is, buddy? I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, so anyways, what do you guys not have roadies? Come on. We don't. Yeah. I know what. So you guys, uh, we were going to talk about, I told you guys what I had. You guys are doing this yes. all wrong. So what I had planned on talking about was something that I we do. Need a, we need to have powwow. Yes. Can we have a meeting? I bet you she does too. I know what you're talking about. The thing that chaps my ass is the stuff that I do. Oh, so I was going to say it was about judging, whether you judge or whether you feel judged. But for me... What chaps my ass is myself because I'm a judging bitch. I, you said that. I, I am, believe that. I am. I judge. I picked up on that. Uh, yeah, did you? <laughs> I mean, I really. I mean, you're, not, you're off the back. Let's just let her talk. I, 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 I really do. I mean, it's and it's the obvious let her, things, let her you know. She's hole. fat, and then again, she's a fat bitch, and then again, she looks at me and she's still fat. But I was gonna also tie in with this ladies' room, you guys. The reason why I know I'm such a bitch yeah. is when I go into the ladies' room, she starts talking to me, and she's really nice, and I'm really nice to her. And like we strange up, women that you don't know. Yeah, strange women that I have literally called fat bitch in my head more than one time. Oh, my God. You know, God. judging them from all over. Judgy, judgy, judgy. And they're really nice. And not only that, um, pretty girls, too, I can see them judge me, right? I know they're looking at me like I'm a bitch. But when we go in the ladies' room, they say something like, you're just so pretty. And they were intimidated. They were Maybe actually they intimidated. Just thought you were really you not pretty. Like, they did. They're Do judgy, you judge though. judge hot girls, too? Or I judge like, them all. Again, I judge everybody. I'm so happy to be a guy. I judge everybody. I've had, I've had so guys many girlfriends judge. tell me this story. Guys no, judge. I don't, like, I don't do these like, girl girls. They're like, girls don't get on with girls, and I don't understand. No, I, I do, but... I'm a I'm a quick judger at first. I really am. Yeah, I see, am we just judging. go, hey, nice time, man. Hey, <laughs> and no. you accept it. You're like, it. I, don't just, I, I hang out with guys that are really judgy, too. They shit talk anybody. Yep. Guys are bad. Guys are terrible. I work gay. with all men. <laughs> what? But not gay ones, right? Not gay oh, they're, they're, just the they're the most judgmental ones. I had a gay man say, you know, that would be cuter, but, you know, you're way too fat for that. No. Wow. Gay guys really? are constructive criticism. <laughs> well, they were not really judgy. I was not confused. They say, don't wear that, wear that. <laughs> yeah, and okay. they would give you their no, own the ones belt. that are catty about it. Catty, yeah. You shouldn't tell bitch. someone they look fat in something unless they ask. <laughs> oh, I would never say it to her. I would just think it in my head or say it behind her back. I wouldn't say it to somebody's face. You That's know what? I, I am proud of you. For, like, you coming forward and saying I, that you thought this stuff in your head, a lot of people wouldn't admit that. So I'm I would have never you. known that. First step you. is admitting you have a problem. Oh, my God. I mean, anyone that <laughs> well, really, my best friend's over here, wise. she knows what a judgmental <laughs> bitch I am. She's shaking her head. It's almost <laughs> falling off. <laughs> that, I don't, I'm not proud of it. No, I wish I could I'm change judging. it, but... 
I mean, as soon as I want, I mean, I'm, I'm just trying to live my I mean, life I, and not I get judged. I notice just... things about people, but I'm certainly not judgmental. Okay, well, and whatever. I... Screw you because you won't say it. <laughs> Screw you because you won't no, say it. Not... I'm not really judgmental. I'd say it. Trust you me. I'd say it. If I was, I'd say it. I'm not really a judgmental bitch. I'm more of an asshole. You just asshole. said you were. I'm an asshole. I was going to say, I, I like don't think it, you're judgmental. I think I'm you're just an asshole. I'm a nice, clean, shaven asshole, okay? I'm not a dirty, ugly one. I'm a nice clean pretty asshole you should really meet my bass player but i am he'd really like you for 50 bucks i'll arrange that <laughs> for 50 bucks i'll arrange for her to get laid i want to know that. if you know, ever been judgmental or felt judged have felt i felt hardly harsh harshly uh by tj no, by, by women i don't know in the bathroom in oh the yeah like i i feel like women are See, really jealous and, and catty yeah, but you know, I've never felt judged by you, you, TJ, ever. I've never felt judged I never by you. I've never got that I've, vibe I've at all. Uh, 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 what's her name? Did? Oh, Carrie. Yeah. Oh God, what's her can name? I, I tell believe you, she was wearing that. Can I tell you? <laughs> remember when we went out the first night? We went terrible. <laughs> you don't want to know. I can't. Sometimes she looked fabulous. This woman is like oh, we are oh, strangers to each other. I did not. Carrie is a model. Like she's like a for She's she's got a fabulous body. She looks fabulous. And TJ, she walks in to come and chill in. And TJ first thing she says is, you're going to wear that? <laughs> <laughs> and Carrie knew no one. Carrie was the new girl. And I was late. It was a joke, though, because I always said to <laughs> I know, Gina, I, I right? know but I thank God like, someone else was there to be the yeah. shit receptacle See, for I the show. I think, <laughs> I think, though, I think if you're not very judgmental yourself, then if something happens to you, you can laugh it off easier. Because you're like, what? Whatever. <laughs> but you know what is funny that happened? Remember, I didn't want to wear that dress the first night we went to, to the bar down the street. Yeah, oh, I, I know. Oh, and everybody room. loved it. This girl I didn't know, out of the blue, goes, "Thank you for wearing that dress." And I'm like, "What the fuck are you talking?" <laughs> and in my head, I was judging that, going, what "The fuck! I knew I shouldn't wear this dress. She's she's being catty. She's yep. being a bitch." And I think she was being nice. I know. She really she was liked being it. Sweet. <laughs> I guess you I just was never know. Because I felt like I do not, I wouldn't have worn it in public. Do you assume otherwise. that you See, know? Insecurity's a bitch, right? Yeah, that sucks. Because then, because then I had to check myself. I was like, what? But but see, can it's because it was like so out of my service. element, like I was out of my comfort zone. Yeah, on TV, my wallet just fell out. You only have a dollar. You stole money in a condom. You said everywhere. He's got a dollar and some change. I see a couple of pennies. What were you going to say? Gina, what were you going to say about that? You said something about that. Oh, I don't know. I mean, I anyway. guess I judge. I judge twice tonight on the show. Really? On you did? Film. Yeah. That I thought men were both men were. Oh yeah, that was judging. Of sexual partners. No, what you said, men weren't even human. They, what, yeah, that was no, pretty judging. No, judgy. I said men aren't people. Aren't but <laughs> I was thinking Steve Irwin. Well, I was well, having, that's not judging at all. No, no. no that's but okay. But it was funny in my head. Oh, oh, oh I thought you said human. Was there Again, I'll me. say it. Who, who hurt you? I love men. Oh, I just. I know. It might now. Do you? You can get past the dust. I can use pity. I can use pity. Pity sex? Stop trying to use things. Just be yourself and have an orgasm, for God's sake. We need to get her laid. No, no, I'm I'm, I'm, good. No, she's not. I am. I'm just The walls are closing in. It's. I don't think there's any entry level. I saw my girlfriend for the first time in five weeks the other night. Trust me, I know. There's way happy village in face in the morning coming for me. Is that it? Oh my god, these fucking pancakes oh, are amazing. <laughs> yeah. I, know I don't know what's going on. I'm so cakes. happy. I love my job. Okay, oh what my else? God, this what else, Chapter, asks about your being? What else do you judge besides females and people? I mean, people, I don't care. You're wearing a sports team hat. I hate you. You know? Um, she hates the Broncos. Oh, can't stand them. Um, you know, I mean, it could be, it could That's be anything. That's popular here, right? <laughs> oh, I don't really care. I'll back it up all day. It's, it's don't you worry. Her favorite worry. team is, I'm sorry. No, oh, don't worry. I have a Bronco sweatshirt. I wear it What's when I team? pick up dog <laughs> shit. And I just don't even have a dog. So, yeah, I'm not worried about it. Well, sportscasters are very opinionated. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's just my opinion. It's, it's just, just what your I opinion. It's just what but you my said ass. that the chapter asked that you are judgmental. Yeah, it does. I mean, because... I really, really get along with everybody, so I don't know why I always put up a quick, you know, a quick flash of I hate you. When <laughs> I really don't, but it's just this negative shit that runs through my head. I don't know. You're going to put your name up in your stall, and people are going to be afraid to use it. They'll no. be like, oh my god, that's you better be afraid. Hell. You better be afraid, because if you do anything wrong in my stall, I'm going to judge you for it. I'm going to watch you as you walk out of my stall, and in my oh, head, no. I'll be shredding you. I'm going to be in there. She's oh going to sit in there smoking, sitting at the sink going... <laughs> 
poop you in my stall. <laughs> be like, yo, did you do that? You're not using my toilet. You're not using she's my gonna toilet. She's going to flash a light in your eyes as you come out. What did you do in my stall? <laughs> when was the last time you got waxed? <laughs> wow. No. <laughs> Bring it home, Gina. You. Always taking it dark. Know. Well, that's you what I'm always thinking. You keep one after the other curveball. I know, right? You don't see it coming. It just comes <laughs> out. I love it. That's why I have to rewatch because I usually miss half of it. It's awesome. Oh, and the shit see. that comes out of her mouth, you're just like, oh my god, what? <laughs> and why? 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 <laughs> why? I have to pick myself yeah. against you people. Oh, oh my, my god, god. we love, love you in a way. Like all you guys know each other. So how? What's your? We start. We knew each other when we started this show. Yep. So what is that? Couple months ago. No. Well, we've been yeah. doing the radio show now for three months. No, we started that after this show, actually. But no, we didn't. We did the radio oh, show. Oh, that's right. First. That's why I did at the show because that's yep. how we got the show. That's how we met. We met random. Well, we did not the radio randomly. show. I invited, yeah. Yeah. She yeah. invited us to, uh, to see Counterculture they, Colorado. Yeah. I didn't know it, but I was judging them. <laughs> <laughs> Some things you have to, in life. Sometimes you have to make a judgment call. It's well, not being judgy, but it, you have to make a judgment so call. So the other you applicants into must have into been retards terribly. I, I mean, I how did she pick us? What was the re what was the rest of the applicants like? Oh my <laughs> god. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back next week. On that note, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> right. Someone will be. So some we might, started getting some might together. Not. It was but anyway. The show we're talking about is Counterculture Colorado. And beyond beyond beyond, 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 beyond. And that's the radio show that we do on KZKORadio.com. You can hear it anytime, anywhere. I'm expecting you to listen. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. Wow. Uh, the restraining order will be yeah. available no, after the show. I'm <laughs> I expected my <laughs> robot to the in the back of the show. Yeah, we, 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 we have a hard out copy there of them. We just make them whenever you need us. We just fill your yeah. name yeah. in. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. We know the DA. Yeah. <laughs> I make creepy ass comments and they just let me hang. <laughs> yeah, she's creepy like that. Anyway, no, that's Counterculture Beyond on KZK Radio, The Vibe. And we do that every Saturday from 1 to 2. And uh, this week on Counterculture, we have a Wiccan who's going to dispel some stigma and some myths about uh, being a Wicca. Wiccan? Wicca? Oh, well, Wiccan? Right. That's a is good witch, yeah. right? Well, it's a. Uh, Glinda is the good dude, witch. Come on. Did you not good witch, watch bad the witch. movie? I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. Liz, do you have anything left for us? Come and see Faster Pussycat. They haven't gone on yet, clearly, because we have him hostage. Come on down. No, <laughs> no, 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 but... I don't know where I am. I don't know what this is. But I've enjoyed every minute. Thank you. As most of Thank you. Do you Thank feel roofied? Liz has something. Yeah, no, I've been... I've been Panning the camera upstairs so that our audience could see some of the show upstairs. All right, awesome. Yeah. Nice. Like the win, right yeah. On. Right so on. definitely come on down tonight, I folks. Yes. <laughs> yes. We are that. Good. Are that good. You, you want to tell me what she's saying? She said that she put a uh, she uh, put some of the show upstairs so that the people watching the show oh, can great. actually see <laughs> us. Yeah, the show. Upstairs. I know he's thrilled now. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! They're waiting for you. They're We're like, gonna go upstairs and party now with Faster Pussycat yep. and the rest of the band here at Herman's Hideaway. Don't forget October eighth. October eighth, make a wish for Alyssa here at Herman's Hideaway. Uh, we got a uh, couple cover bands, cover yeah, bands of Deftones yeah. and oh, like several Deftones. bands. We'll be back. Yeah. You know what? He's gonna be on Counterculture we'll in a couple go weeks. Go to we'll uh, Herman's yeah, and Hideaway. We'll be talking about it. Check out their event page, and uh, you'll see it all there. Yep, yeah. and we'll be talking about it in the upcoming shows too on the radio oh, and yeah. as well as here next week. Definitely, because that's for Make a Wish Foundation for Alyssa this time. Yep, and uh, she wants to go to Disney World. I told him just have her come meet us. We're princesses. Yeah. Right, Liz is a princess. Yeah. I think she yeah. is. Yeah. That's not no. good enough. No, no. Although no. one of the princesses is really judgmental. <laughs> oh. Yeah, she's a wicked woman. Hey, why don't you shut the fuck sister. up? I'll bring the apple. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come back next week, or you know what? Tell your friends, share our show. You can share it anytime, anywhere on worldviral.tv, as you know, because you're watching it right now. Any, any last words? I don't know. Final I mean, words? Any I'm last words? You? Just I'm looking at you. Yes. 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 You know. Close it out. Come on. Yes. I know you have Be it. Be back <laughs> next week in the ladies' room. <laughs>